Okay everybody, welcome back to the channel. Today we've got an explosive experiment lined up that is guaranteed to blow your blocks off. I can't wait to show you this ridiculously OP TNT add-on. This is definitely not your regular Minecraft TNT. We are going to take it to a whole new level. Before we dive in, make sure to check the link in the description below. There you will find access to the add-on via a link so you can join the chaotic fun yourself. And guess what? It's not just for Minecraft Education Edition, whether you're on Bedrock or Pocket Edition, you can spice up your explosions with this incredible add-on. Now, picture this, a humble Minecraft house, standing tall and unsuspecting. We're starting with the classic TNT and then progressively escalating through a series of OP TNTs, each more powerful than the last. But hold on to your diamond helmets because we are not stopping at just one house, oh no. We are turning up the heat until we reach a whole city, complete with buildings streets and parks. It's a spectacle of destruction you don't want to miss, so sit back, relax and get ready to witness the explosive power of our OP TNT add-on. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and ring the notification bell so you never miss out on our Minecraft education adventures. Now, without further ado, let the chaos commence. Let's dive into the mayhem right here in Minecraft City Demolition. Okay, here we are in our first of many experiments, our scenarios, and we're starting with regular old TNT from vanilla Minecraft. Two blocks always placed in the same place so that we can compare and contrast. And uh, first of all, you can see the regular TNT makes a pretty predictable sized crater there. Pretty powerful stuff, uh, but we're going to be taking it to the next level with the fire TNT. Two blocks in the same place. Now this one has a pretty similar destructive power to regular TNT, but as you can see, when it explodes, it sends off these kind of bits of fire everywhere. And this house, you know, it's got a birch wood floor, so that isn't ideal. Uh, pretty good start, I'm pretty impressed by that, but we can do better. We can bring in bigger and better TNT. Here is the next one, it's called Super TNT. And um, it's a notch up. It's a notch up on the ladder, and uh, this one should give us a bit of a bigger explosion. Two blocks there. Let's see what these ones do. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, decent explosion. It's taken a big chunk out the front of the house. Nice sized crater. I like the Super TNT. Um, it's just that next step up, unless you want to go crazy. Talking about going crazy, mega TNT. Um, this is another notch up even higher so let's see what happens to the house here two blocks in the exact same place remember what the regular TNT did and how's this one going to compare got quite a long ignition time this was. all right okay yeah a little bit bigger the, the radius is bigger it's taken out all the windows and glass on the front all the front wall pretty much has gone and a good size crater ultimate TNT um, we're taking it up a notch. Two ultimate t TNTs. Let's get those ignited. And then I think after this is only one more. So this is going to be pretty pretty big to this house. Remember the, the first regular TNT didn't even really break the front wall very much. Um, and left a bit of a crater. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so this one, it's left a huge crater. The whole front of the house has gone and a lot of the back of the house. We've gone right through uh, to whatever that is. I wouldn't call it bedrock. Just we've gone through to the underneath of the world right this next one's called world destroyer um, and this is pretty serious now these are huge chunks of TNT let's light them up and see what they do the world destroyer just two blocks of this to see how much damage it does <laughs> Wow yeah definitely that took it up a notch so that pretty much destroys the whole house just a couple of blocks of these world destroyer TNTs but I know what we need to do next uh, we need to reset this house and we need to do operation crater because we are going to just absolutely fill this house uh, pretty much every spare block that we can with the world destroyer TNT and just uh, see what it does I'm a little bit worried for my computer here uh, but in the name of science um, I'm going to allow it, even though it might completely break my computer. And we're just going to fill this whole house with TNT. Let's light it there. And just take a little step back, probably a little bit further than we did last time. We've got an awful lot of TNT. And, okay, a lot of lag. 
<laughs> I don't. Okay. Um, not done too much damage more than I... Oh, okay. There was a lot of lag. And now the whole house and everything around it is gone. It's just disappeared. Operation Crater was a success. But we can go bigger. We can go Operation Bye Bye Mayor. Uh, because this city that we're in has a mayor. And um, we want to annoy the mayor a little bit by just destroying this building near him. We'll put some TNT around him to keep him safe. Uh, let's go inside. Actually, another layer. There we go. Let's go inside the building and just absolutely pack this whole um, building. We'll call it the mayoral office. Is that what it's called? Um, where the mayor kind of lives and works. And we're going to pack this place out with World Destroyer TNT. Obviously, it's got a huge duck on the front. Whether that will still be there at the end will remain to be seen. Here we go. And the lag is back. Um, I don't know if it's just going to do the same again and suddenly... Wow. Okay, that building is gone. And there is TNT all over the place. The computer's just trying to catch up with the lag. Whoa. <laughs> okay. So... That's left quite a large crater. I see why they call it the World Destroyer, because that is a massive, massive crater. It's looking good. Um, and as we move around, the computer is loading up. Yeah, there's more explosions going on. There's a basketball court. Oh, my word. Well, that, that's not the mayor, is it? He's okay. I think, yeah, it is. It's the mayor. I'm glad he survived. That's good to know. Um, yeah, that's left... There's still explosions going on. Look, I think it's time for for one last thing. Operation No More Town. We're just going to get rid of this town now and completely obliterate it. And the way I plan to do this is by using a command block. We're going to learn about command blocks now. Why not? We'll set it to repeat, always active, and we're going to summon a world underscore destroyer. Uh, TNT here. Lovely. And it should just start kind of spitting out... Uh, TNT if this if we've typed this incorrect <laughs> yeah yeah we've typed it incorrectly and there's a lot of TNT just flying out of this um, command block let's just check are they going is it going up onto the next floor it is that's pretty cool um, not the third floor but that spider's about to uh, have an interesting day isn't he when this all kicks off down here um, I think we better light this now because the TNT is going to I think if we if we let it run too long, my computer's going to completely overload and crash. Uh, let's stand back. So this is the explosion that I think is just going to keep on giving. And it's all going to blow up. And then TNT is going to come out and keep exploding. Um, if my computer can withstand... Oh my word. If my computer can withstand the sheer amount of explosions that are going on. Bearing in mind that as this is happening, uh, hundreds more TNT blocks are getting sent out of... Oh, yeah, that's looking good. It's a decent sized crater. It's gonna keep. Oh, wow. Yeah, it's still going. Okay. I like this. I like this. This is a good way to destroy a big section of your world. As we move around, this j <laughs> it's just loading chunks of destruction as we walk around. Of course, if you just want to turn that. Um, command block off. You can go to settings and disable command blocks. That's simple enough. Or just walk up to it and destroy it. That's totally fine. I, <laughs> yeah. I, I'm surprised my computer's still going through this, to be honest. I mean, it's lagging a lot, but it's going strong. And this town is just, as we walk through it, yeah, there's not much left, is there? I mean, look at that. Conclusion! What have we learnt? Well, we've learnt that this uh, add-on is awesome, and if you want to download it, you can go to the link in the description and download that. Please do make sure you like and subscribe to the channel if you enjoyed today's series of experiments. Like I said, we did this on uh, Education Edition, but it should work even better in Pocket and Bedrock Edition as well. Uh, test out all the different types of TNT and let me know in the comments down below if you enjoyed uh, using this in your worlds and how you used it and what effect it had on your world. World, okay right guys thanks for tuning in and i will see you all later in the week